so happy guys Bitcoin broke the 8.5 resistance which was a huge resistance made me jump into the sea in today's videos guys Bitcoin went to 9k what is next Binance broke its all-time high in trading volume there is going to be a Bitcoin manga series somewhere in Japan there was a coinbase crash during uh, the Bitcoin move yesterday I'm going to show you the halving numbers of the last halvings and why we could see a small correction at the moment be but not need to fear also going to show you why COVID is good for Bitcoin and other online businesses I'm going to show you this beautiful chart where you can see we had seven green weekly candles and what this means for the future if we look back there is an amazing new app that will pay you Bitcoin for just walking imagine what I will earn with walking this beach every day uh, I'm going to sign up to the app as soon as possible and we are going to talk a little bit about the children's future and how we should lead by example and I'm doing an Instagram live next Saturday so I will talk a little bit about this as well Good morning guys on this rainy day on Kompangan. Is it raining? Yes. Do I care? No. Why? Because Bitcoin just went up with 15% yesterday. An amazing day to wake up. Bitcoin up. Um, all the things I've been making videos about in the last two weeks seem to come true now, which is really cool. A week ago I said, 9k is still in play we could see bitcoin we could bitcoin slowly climbing up to 10k now in the next week and then a few days ago uh, again again i said okay guys warning we can slowly approach the 9k now we are going to break the 8.4k probably and then maybe even see 9k and now what happened this beautiful day yesterday we went up to 9k this is so cool yes guys bitcoin went all up to 9k that's a beautiful start of the day man i'm feeling so excited for you out there because i know a lot of us were waiting for some moves in bitcoin and a lot of us were afraid of a huge crash back to 3k and so i'm very happy for you guys that we went to 9k and of course i'm happy for myself as well because i also understand that the increase of bitcoin prices will uh, also lead to an increase of people knowing about bitcoin i've been talking about bitcoin move um, the last week in the last few videos i think a week ago i said wow maybe bitcoin could be in play for the 9k and um, at that point that was really doubtful of course but we broke the 8.4k like it was nothing like a knife through the butter bam and we are now almost around 9k of course i understand we will have a correction from here um, we cannot go up that fast without correcting i think for the future the most important level now is 10.5k if we will be able to break ten thousand five hundred dollar then i really become bullish bullish because that one is a very strong resistance and as you know if we break strong resistances we can see a very strong move upwards but then again history has shown has shown us that always leading up to the halving bitcoin sees this small increase and then after halving we can also see a correction if i'm correct <laughs> correction if i'm correct the last halving um, the first month after the halving we saw a 11% drop 11 is my favorite number so let's go for this 11% drop again the first month after the, maybe we will we'll be able to go up to 10k or something like this and then we will have a correction of 11% so that will bring us back to the 8.9k area um, which I wouldn't be very sad about uh, if you look at the halving in a bigger time frame and we zoom a little bit out then we can also see that a year after the halving we always saw this beautiful top of the bull run so I think it's going to be a very exciting year from 2020 May 
till December 2021. Wow, beautiful numbers. I think Bitcoin is going to show its strength. I think we are going to see another bull run like we have seen um, in 2017 and in 2013. This is just going to be repeating history in my opinion. But who am I? I am not an official trader. I am not your financial advisor. I'm just this crazy dude, long haired dude, walking on the beach in Copacan, Thailand because he's in lockdown because of governments taking back control and breaking our democracy or hacking our democracy and killing all our human and civil rights. <laughs> Guys, Binance yesterday had an all-time high in trading. CZ tweeted it was an all-time high of 11 billion in 24 hours. 11 billion was traded in the last 24 hours. Congrats, Binance, with this amazing achievement of passing this all-time high of trading volume in 24 hours. Amazing to hear. Also very positive, of course for the Bitcoin community. And it starts to rain again and I still don't give a fuck because man, I am so happy today for whole crypto community. At the same time, the crypto belief in Europe is increasing. You know, last year about 60% believed that Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies would still be there in 10 years time. This year, the measurements tell us that 66% of Europe believes that Bitcoin and other cryptos will still be there in 10 years. The biggest increase we saw in Italy during the uh, COVID-19 situation, most people in Italy now understand the strength of Bitcoin. Even I think the biggest bank of Italy, Seca or Sella, I don't know how it's called, I will put the name somewhere, started, uh, started to accept Bitcoin buys and sells directly from their banking app, which is amazing news for mass adoption of course but please 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 people if you buy these bitcoins using this banking app or using the banking system make sure you huddle the bitcoins on your ledger or other hardware wallet so that nobody can ever take them away from you if you want to buy a ledger or a hardware wallet um, i have a link in the description where you can buy the, all of the wallets in japan Bitcoin world is going crazy. There is a Bitcoin manga series being made. I think manga was something about this animated Bitcoin or something. So this is really cool. Also cool for mass adoption because of probably a lot of kids, pubers and, and even adults watch these manga movies. And now we have a crypto Bitcoin version of the manga's movies. Oh my God, this rain feels so good. This feels so good, the rain, because you know, it has been hot the last few weeks. Coinbase had a crash during the run from Bitcoin yesterday. Oh my God, it starts to feel like 2017 again, where every time that Bitcoin you know, had a small bull run or increased with $1,000 or $2,000, many exchanges seemed to crash during that time. Do you, do you see, do you sense I'm very happy today? COVID, about COVID, research shows that COVID is very positive for Bitcoin and other online businesses. You all know, I believe that it's just a normal seasonal flu and that we will conquer this flu again, probably because of, because of herd immunity, just like Sweden did and many other countries are doing. Um, but then again, you know, I feel very sorry for all the people that were affected by COVID. But man, 150,000 people die every day. So the chance that, that, that there are a few COVID patients between them yeah, is there, of course. But you know, as the governments uh, are telling us now themselves, everybody that dies at the moment and has COVID is calculated as a COVID death. So even if this guy dies of cancer, even if this, die, if this guy dies of other internal bleedings or whatever, because he had COVID at that time, he's registered as a COVID dead. See this short clip where even the governments admit this. Information to fill out death certificates, whether the person's been diagnosed with COVID-19 or not, but then to say in the death certificate, this person's death was caused by COVID-19. That, that does not sound right to me. Even if you died of a clear alternate cause, but you had COVID at the same time, it's still listed as a COVID death. People who got COVID on their death certificate, it doesn't necessarily mean they were infected because many of them haven't 
this case. Everyone who's listed as a COVID death doesn't mean that that was the cause of the death, but they had COVID at the time of death. It's called lockstep. <laughs> But COVID is good for the online businesses. Why? Because all online businesses like Amazon have seen an increase in revenue. Why? Because people are locked up at home. They start to spend online instead of offline. So there is an increase of online spending. And if there is an increase of online spending, people are using digital currencies your euro or dollar is also a digital currency it's just numbers in a banking system that they change from the one to the other end but they are in control but now people are also starting to use bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies to pay online because people want to have control on their own assets so yes positive for bitcoin because online spending is getting more popular online shopping is getting more popular and bitcoin and other cryptos are going to be a huge part of the online shopping experience in the near future there's another beautiful beautiful thing that we can see in the bitcoin chart we have seen seven weekly closing green candles in a row this has only happened about i'm going to turn it's about only about happened about like four or five times in history and every time this happened so seven green candles in a row we saw a bull run just after to be honest i calculated the weekly candles and it was mostly seven candles and then the eighth weekly candle even also green and then we saw a reversal um of like a correction about like 10 to 30 percent it was different every year we are now in the seventh green candle weekly candle so we could see an eighth weekly candle after this if we close this one green and then then you need to watch out because a history shows that after the eighth weekly candle we will see a correction so please if this eighth weekly candle and pops up on your screen on your trading view screen or whatever chart uh, you use be aware that we can see a correction after we see eight green candles in a row because we have never seen more green candles in the past there is an app developed that will pay you in satoshis for walking and do doing other daily activities I already registered for the app I want to have very I want to have access why um, because you know I am walking daily on this beach even when it's raining I'm walking to create this content and while working I now can start to earn sets how cool is this uh, I think the app is called something like smile smile Bitcoin or something um, I think you can pre-register at the moment I already did this uh, yes and I hope they will of course approve my registration because then I can start testing the app and I'm a huge 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 example of how you can work, walk the beaches in Thailand and at the same time earn some bitcoins by doing so that's so cool I also want to mention the t-shirt I'm wearing you can see it to be or not to be many people comment very positive on this shirt this shirt is for sale in our shop on the bitcoinfamily.com 
I think it's about like 14 euros or 13 euros to buy the shirt. Um, about 25% is going to uh, poor people all over the world or NGOs. We sell more shirts. There's also this Miss B shirt, which the kids designed for women and some other Bitcoin articles just check the shop and you will see what we are selling in the shop okay then uh, after all the happiness uh, i also want to do some serious stuff of course guys as you know you know i'm i'm a very big supporter of leading by example i think we need to lead by example for our kids and now in these times we are living in very important times man very important times there is happening so much all over the world. They are taking and breaking down our democracy. They are even taking like our human rights, our civil rights. Man, they are making decisions. For example, in the Netherlands, decisions are being made by the governments, but there is not even an option for the opposite parties to even vote against or work against all the things that now are decided by the prime minister and this is really sad because this means they don't give a shit about our rights they don't give a shit about democracy and they only give a shit about that what they want this is very sad i really believe that if we don't stand up now if we don't all wake up and see how massively we have been fooled the last few years and now especially during this flu season how massively a fool we have been by the government but also by the mass media and if we don't wake up now we will not leave a bright future for our kids even worse we will leave a future that looks like enslavement for our kids we are now the people to stand up to give our kids a beautiful bright future out of uh, where they have a, all the freedom they want we don't want to leave a future for the kids where they will be enslaved in the system that is full having full control of everything they think do say or where they go this is not the future for my kids and i can't believe you want to see this future for your kids i saw this beautiful video uh, from a guy I've been following it's called the crow house he left a very beautiful poem at the end of his video this beautiful poem does perfectly express my feelings towards what we are doing as parents at the moment so that's why I want to thank the crow house for making this beautiful video about the situation all over the world and by sharing this poem I am going to leave this video with the same poem because I think people will then understand exactly what we are doing and I think guys we really really need to wake up that was the serious part and yes bright news because we passed 3,000 subscribers yesterday that was a huge resistance we have been fighting against as the Bitcoin family for about ooh, seven months and we were always hanging around 2,800 2,900 2,850 but yesterday we broke the resistance we officially now have more than 3,000 subscribers that are watching our content I am so thankful for you all guys subscribing to our content and viewing our content because without you guys I would just be the stupid guy walking on the beach talking through a telephone and no audience and that is not how we change the world I can only change the world together with you guys I can only educate you about what we do and what is happening in the world by making these videos and that's why I appreciate so much you're watching them Thank you guys for watching this video again. If you do like the videos, then please give it a thumbs up. Please share it in, in your communities. We need some more followers. Hit the bell button and subscribe so that you will be notified on every video I make. See you guys again tomorrow, hopefully on a less rainful day, because as you know, 
after the rain comes sunshine and it's not only for the weather that's also for life yes we have difficult times now but these times will change and we will be having all the freedom again to run across beaches walk into pockets uh, celebrate festivals and do all the stuff we love as human beings have a very beautiful day and see you tomorrow again bye Sometimes it burns Sometimes it hurts When you say my name But thinking of hers I don't wanna know, don't want you to go